guys, how's it going? I hope all of you are doing great today. Check it out guys, we are back with Azura Isles working on the resource island that we started in the previous video. And guys, first off, sorry for the little break that we took on this series. There was a lot of stuff going on with the university in real life. And you know, all of the stuff that you have to unfortunately take care of when the older you get. But... Yeah, I just need a little break of it and I wanted to do something fresh. But yes guys, we are back and today is probably going to be the final episode where we do some building. Which means we are finishing off the series. That is right. I really had a lot of fun with this build. Even though, yeah, it did take a little more time than I thought it did. And it did get a little repetitive when we were building all of the houses on the other island. But guys, I have to say... I still really had a lot of fun overall, and I am really happy with how it turned out in the end. Which actually brings me to a question that I have for you guys. I actually still have all of the footage of the entire build. So that is around 12 or 14 hours of footage, I believe. And yeah, my question for you is, would you like me to make a final, final episode of Azura Isles? <laughs> Where we actually don't build anything new, but instead compress all of that building footage into one final, yeah, tour or montage episode, I guess if you can call it that. Similar like we did with the finale of the Fishbowl base, if you guys remember. But yeah, if you like that idea, let me know in the comment section. And yeah, if you think the idea is crap, hey, you know, let me know as well. I think it would be a really cool thing to do. But yeah, at the end of the day, you're the people who watch it. And if you rather want to see some new builds, that is totally fine with me as well. Anyways, guys, just let me know in the comment section. <laughs> but yeah, guys, today, as you can probably see right now, we are building a magical wheat field. And this suggestion actually came from one of you guys. So now, I am actually really sorry, but I am not going to attempt to pronounce your name. Since, yeah, I'll just, I'll just completely butcher it anyway. So, right now on the screen, here you go. Yes, you. You suggested that we build some wheat and potato fields, which have a magic frozen water crystal piercing and hydrating the land. And yeah, I actually really, really like this idea. I actually wanted to build this in the previous episode, but I unfortunately ran out of time. But yeah, now you can see it now. Anyways, so you can see right now, we are adding these really cool ice spikes, which are stuck in the wheat field. And yeah, they're giving the soil and the plants the necessary water to survive. <laughs> I think that's a cool idea. But yeah, I really like it since it adds more detail to the build rather than just, you know, having a plain old farming patch. And yeah, it also adds a little backstory or some lore to the build, which I think, yeah, it makes it a lot more fun to build, I really have to say. But anyways, guys, speaking of backstories, the village will need a place where they can process all of that wheat into flour, for example. Because <laughs> I mean, guys, honestly, what good is a wheat field without the ability to process all of that wheat, guys? Seriously. <laughs> but yeah, we are going to be adding a windmill to the island. That's right. We've got this really cool area right now on the edge of the island. And I think it's a perfect place to build a sweet windmill overlooking that ocean and the land beyond it. We'll be using mostly wood and stone for this build. And yeah, I tried to give it a bit more of a fantasy twist to it with large... Wait, what do you call those things? The the windmill wheel? The, the rudder? No idea, guys. You'll probably... Yeah, you'll probably let me know in the comment section. But yeah, I tried to add a fantasy twist to it rather than just keep the whole thing in a simple medieval style. Since, yeah, that's what we were originally going for in the end. And I have to say, I really enjoyed how this final episode turned out. I feel like the builds really fit together and complement themselves in a good way. And yeah, it... It just looks really good, guys. I don't know. Let me know. Anyways, <laughs> that is actually pretty much all I wanted to talk about today. So let me know in the comment section, guys, if you want to see that final montage of all of that footage that we have collected. Or if you want to rather move on to new builds. Because trust me, guys, even though I don't have a lot of time and I have a lot of stuff to do for university, I've still got a bunch of sweet ideas that I'm just waiting to find some time to make a good video on. I think that toward Christmas actually, I think my time should clear up a bit and 
yeah, I think I'll have quite a bit of time to make some awesome videos for you guys. Anyways, that is going to be it from me. So, how about you guys sit back, relax, and enjoy the final episode of Azura Isles. Thank you.